All right, okay. So let's wrap this up. I can't beat that. that that's a wonderful inspiration, uh, inspirational message there. But let me see if I can put a smile on your face with the weather. Now today, the big story is it's going to be windy, folks. If you drive a high-profile vehicle, uh, you want to use caution. If you've got outso uh, outside furniture, uh, plants, I know we have a lot of plants at our house. If you've got those Halloween decorations outside, you want to tie them down or just bring them in uh, just for one day. It's still going to be breezy moving forward, but not as windy as it's going to be today. Here's something to put a smile on your face. If you if you want a little springtime weather like weather as we get into Friday, we could see temperatures maybe trying to push into the 70s for some with lots of sunshine. But alas, it does not last as we're going to cool down heading back into the weekend. It's a really a beautiful start across Yellowstone County right now. 38 at the airport feels like 28 dew points at 29 winds out of the southwest at about 18 miles an hour. So they're creeping up just a little bit. Take a look at temperatures across the viewing area right now. My friends in Miles City at 36 on the western side. White Sulphur Springs at 39, 46 in Livingston, Columbus at 32 down in Sheridan. We're at 31 right now across the state. You can see off to our west where we do have some uh, lower elevation rain, some higher elevation snow. We actually still have a chance to see some rain in our viewing area today uh, east of Yellowstone. County, Mile City, Ekalaka, Glendive could see a few drops of rain. We'll see some snow in the Bear Tooths and maybe the Southern Bighorns today as well. But there's your big story the winds. We saw some gusts earlier today over 40 miles an hour. Uh, Great Falls also around Cutbank. Uh, these winds kind of migrating from west to east as we go along today. We'll start to see the stronger stuff hit by lunchtime this afternoon and then taper off as the day goes on from west to east. Still going to be breezy as we move forward uh, during the week, but it's not going to be as windy. And there are your high wind warnings in effect. Those areas shaded there and kind of that off yellow and the light brown there. That's where you have your wind advisory. So again, one of those days, if you drive a high profile vehicle, you just want to use caution. It's also going to be chilly today. Some of us may not get out of the 40s. We're still behind that cold front. We do have all that moisture for the most part trying to drag with it. So again, on the eastern side of our viewing area, a chance where we could see maybe some rain, uh, some snowfall again in the Beartooths and the Bighorns. But when are we going to get our shot at possibly seeing maybe some snow? Well, your jury's still out. Maybe Saturday morning a rain snow mix, maybe a wintry mix for Billings. We'll have to keep an eye on that as we get closer to the weekend. Very windy today, though. Uh, we're going to get up to about 49 in Livingston, a high today of 52. Um, uh, Mile City getting up to about 56. We'll go Sheridan, a high of 57 today. Billings will get up to about 56. Look at that, knocking on the door of 70 on Friday, then cooling down for the weekend. Mm -hmm.